Time for our Wingate by Wyndham postgame interview with head coach Britt Bonneau. You fall 9-6 today, coach, but uh, the way the game ended, the last five innings, put a different feeling uh, to me on the game. What do you think? Well, I felt like it kind of turned some of the momentum going into tomorrow's game. You know, we preach a lot about, uh, um, you know, you know, when, when, when a team gets gets ahead of you, which they had a nine spot on us, um, what you do at the end of that game, what you do to, to, to reverse the momentum to get you to the next game is huge. And uh, felt like uh, Nathan came in, threw great strikes for us. Uh, I think he had five strikeouts, put some zeros up. Uh, our young guys started hitting on top of the baseball. We had some extra base hits, uh, put up a two spot there. And then um, in the ninth inning, we did it again. We were able to get on top of the baseball and put a four spot up. At least we got into their bullpen, got to see some of their better arms. And, uh, you know, that helps us prepare for tomorrow because now we know what they have. You think the momentum in a game, at the end of one game, even in a loss, affects the next day? Oh, absolutely, because it's a war the whole weekend. And you're always trying to get an upper hand or feel good about what you're doing. Um, you know, if we just fall over in that game and end up getting beat nine to nothing, or or maybe even let it get out of hand, you know, we're not feeling good right now. We're not feeling good about coming in here in the morning um, and, and learning to compete. We have to learn these. We have to teach these kids that it's always a war. You got to crave it. You got to get ready every single inning, and you got to get the momentum shifted. And uh, you know, we got some confidence going you know, uh, with our hitters with with coming back and getting those hits and, and getting those extra base hits and scoring some runs. I mean, it's hard to put four runs up uh, this day and age. And so putting up a four spot just gives us some confidence. Now we just need to get our starting pitching going a little bit to get to those back end guys, um, which have done a really good job for us. Last night, you used some guys whom you wanted to get into the game early uh, in the season. Today, you went with a couple of guys uh, you've you've used in some late game situations, guys like Joe Gurria, he and Nate Cole, whom you mentioned. They retired 17 of the last 20 hitters they faced, and they were still having their big boppers in there. That's right, and you know those two guys are guys that we need in the middle innings. Guys that uh, have have experience, they have college baseball experience, and they have it at a high level. Um, so nothing's really phased them. Uh, they, they've been through uh, uh, the war that we went through last year, um, and so they have a, they have more confidence and know what kind of what's around the corner. Um, we need those guys. We need those guys to put up those zeros because if, if we if we can get some good starting pitching and guys that can get us to the fifth or sixth inning and then be able to go to those guys, and then don't forget, we still got a Sheets and a Palacios and a Zotica behind them. That's how you win ball games. but we have to learn how to do that. Tomorrow you go with Garrett DeMeyer. Uh, he, uh, as good as Nevada is, he saw some terrific teams, some terrific hitting lineups last season. Uh, I know you have a lot of confidence. What what can we expect? What do you expect from him on Sunday? Well, what we what we hope to get is the Garrett that we know, the guy that can hit his spots. When you hit your spots, you tend to be able to uh, go deep into a ball game. Uh, if we, uh, just like Cole did today, just like Gurria did today, when they, they hit their spots and they were able to get through uh, two or three innings for us. And so we need Garrett to do that for us so that then we can go to uh, these other guys that, that everybody knows about, uh, that we can get them in the game to hopefully um, you know, put us in a situation to win a ball game.